previously on Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke. Wookie went through a forest with a Chansley, finally making it to the second gym leader town. Hold up. Is that really all we did last episode? Damn. Oh well. On to the next adventure in this episode, where we finally fight the second gym leader. Hee haw, everyone. Hello, everyone. Are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie. I actually don't know if yee haw counts as a hello. Yee haw, everyone. It's me, Purple Wookie, and I'm back with another Pokemon Nuzlocke. Today, what we're gonna do, I think we're gonna go fight the next gym leader. So let's get into it. Let's see, let's check a current, check it on our Pokemon. So I'm assuming this person is grass, and if so, then Soy Rock over here is going to completely blast it apart. So I recently was taking a shower, um, and I realized something. Uh, I don't know how I'm gonna handle the third gym. <laughs> None of my book. Oh, so I'm not, I don't think I'm at the gym yet. Now that I look at this place, this doesn't look like a gym place. No, it is. Hello, Barry. Oh, you're not Barry, you're Grand Cross. Hey, Biscuit. Yeah, that third gym. I don't know how, what the hell I'm gonna do against that Lucario. This man's gonna just talk about some bullshit, so we're just gonna skip right past it. Never mind. Yee haw, everyone. So this is Atari's Pokemon statue, shaping our world, our time and space, and intertwining spiral. Revered and Sinnoh are the Pokemon of time and space. Sinnoh's myth is true, needs investigation. Yeehaw, everyone. Part of me, stand aside. Get along, little doggy. I'm Cyrus. That's canonically how Cyrus talks. <laughs> Now that I'm deep into this, if you like the rival in this gen, can you please tell me why? Because every time he speaks, he speaks like an idiot. <gasps> Never mind that. Hello. Hello, Cynthia. That's right. Come to Biscuit. It is really funny that it's like, <laughs> she's just in sprite form but even as a kid I was like I bet she looks really good when you actually go try and try, uh, battle her they don't give this much detail to a woman sprite um, a woman sprite until you know way later wait what? they don't give this much detail to a woman sprite in a Pokemon game if they're not also extremely pretty but to be fair I think every Pokemon gym leader is pretty I can't really speak to one that isn't I mean, there's some that are old, but even the old ones are very pretty for <laughs> being old, so... I don't know. Tell me if you feel that there are any specific... Like, even if, if someone were to say, like, Oh man, no, you're, you're tripping, Wookie. This person is ugly. And it's like, are they? Are they ugly, or do you just find them unattractive? Like, there's a difference. Also, hello. Speaking of attractive, our next attractive ship leader is here. Ooh, boy. Hello. I don't know why I'm talking to you. I never talk to you. Leave me be. You're giving good advice, it's just that I don't need it. I played Pokemon games. I know the grass field area. Wait, what? I know the grass field area is <laughs> signs of a grass gym leader. I'm not, you know, dumb. Alright, now comes the true battle. How long will this take me? Oh, not very. Alright, Raiders fan, let's get you some training. If Raiders fan can wing, learn wing attack, that would be actually awesome for us. We need him specifically for that gym leader fight. Let me use Supersonic. Give me the suck all you'd like, man. It does nothing to me. Technically speaking, never mind. I could have said something very stupid, so I decided that. <laughs> I'll save it for another day. <laughs> See, intelligence isn't um, being smart. Intelligence is realizing you're about to say some stupid shit 
and stopping yourself from saying the stupid shit. Because you understand what you're about to say is extremely stupid. Now, I bet you're wondering right now, it's like, Loki, how do you, why do you say that? Well, I'm like, well, there's a lot of people who are technically smart. Um, and they will, you know, use big words or they'll talk to you as if they are aware of certain things. And for all intents and purposes, they actually do know what they're talking about. The difference is that they're fucking stupid because they open their mouths and say stupid shit. And that's what makes you actually an idiot. Hello, lady. I'm now going to beat you up. Aroma lady. Hello, Jenna. I'm just gonna bite the crap out of your plants if you don't mind. See, I used to just uh, style on them, and now Raider's Pan has evolved to just biting fools. He used to dunk sick dunks, and now he's just. <laughs> he learned how to bite people, and now he won't do anything but that. <laughs> Hello, Badoo. Are you ready to get it? Bitten. Twice bitten. One shot. This is insane. This man is non-stop flinching this goddamn Badoo. You know what? It was literally up in its face, gnawing at its top knot, and it still is not able to stop Raiders fan. Yay, thank you. You know, just checking. Y'all really made this part of the gym and then put something there for me? This is maybe the most easiest structured gym ever. <laughs> They've made a very, very complicated clock for no fucking reason. <laughs> but whatever. What is the like? I wonder if every gym leader just has like a design dock, and then they have like a certain amount of money that they can spend, and if they don't spend that money, then they basically lose it. Because that has to be the only explanation as to why some gyms just are so crazy balls to the wall prepared. Like, do you remember the last guy? We fought, the last gym leader we fought, Rorik? Rorik didn't even have a fucking, like... He didn't even have rocks to stop his shit. It was, like, literally just a clear path to him, and you could easily avoid the minor trainer if you wanted. Like, gym... <laughs> gyms... Gyms at level 1 have such sh bad design. Because literally any starting trainer can get to it, but then like, it's not that it's bad design, it's very like, we had a hundred dollars and here you go, rock type gym leader. You don't actually get to have fun with anything you want to do. And then the second gym leader is like, alright, I want a giant clock in the middle, grass, filled with grass. Every time a trainer beats, also constantly moving the water fountains. The water has to be constantly moving, I don't want a gate, I want water, because <laughs> water goes with the flower motif. Kept me waiting, huh? Hello, Gardenia. Not to be confused with Gardevoir, the Pokemon that everyone wants to, well, everyone wants to bang. Speaking of banging, versus. See, look at that. That's an extremely attractive female. I like her look. I like her pants. The fact that I don't think she's wearing a shirt is also extremely attractive to me. I prefer girls who don't wear shirts. Bold statement, I know. Just the same way that women prefer men who don't wear shirts, like Sephiroth. Okay, I'm gonna stop using Confuse Ray because this is apparently the smartest turt twig in the history of the world. And I'm just gonna wing attack you. I'm gonna wing it. Oh no. I forgot that you're a tank, turt twig. <laughs> I'm gonna actually go back to the Confuse Ray. Super I. It's fine. Fucking finally! It took six goddamn supersonics! Alright, let's get you healed up, Raiders fan. Before you accidentally get crit and die. Okay, glad I used that supersonic. He's about to heal himself, too. I'm, he's about to just, like, not be confused anymore, and it's gonna be all for nothing. Hmm, what will I do? I think I'm gonna cast Sunny Day. It's not really helping me. But... I don't know, I like the sunlight. That's me. That's a personal Turtwig thing. Just Turt things. 
I'm not confused anymore. Yay. That was so dumb. Why did I fucking waste my time doing that? He would have been dead in the amount of times I needed to use wing attack. <sighs> it's fine. How dare you use a fucking super potion, you whore! You unbelievable. <laughs> unbelievable. The fucking balls on this woman. That's why he's taking so much damage from him. Like, why the fuck is he taking so much damage from us? Because he's using a barrier. Damn it, who allowed gym leaders to be smart? Use another potion. Take a sip. Sip some Gatorade. That's right, all potions in this uh, run are canonically Gatorades that I throw to my Pokemon. Die, Turtwig. Uh, it was like level 22, I don't know why I didn't... I don't know why she didn't evolve it. Oh, it's sunny day, but it's not actually Sunday, so you're not going to be actually able to... Forget what my special. It's fine. I'm not gonna take much damage from it. It never misses. I know that, but it's fine because it's just gonna get its ass kicked by a wing attack eventually. The reflect can't last forever, and I don't care how much you're gonna give Raider Fan the suck. Eventually, the wing attack will kill you. There we go. Get ready to get completely blasted apart. Safgarde. Does nothing. Leave my presence. How are you still fucking alive? This does more damage than anything else that they were trying to do. Okay. Use the potion once again. See, the thing I'm actually afraid of is this magical leaf getting a crit. Okay, it deals 8 damage, and then I lose how much to this? 5. So at the worst, 16 plus 5. Not enough to kill me. So I'm gonna go wing attack, in case they got a crit. That's the reason I was doing maps. I'm now in kill range. It's fine, because they're gonna use a super potion. Like two steps away from bringing in Soy Rock, just as I'm getting tired of this fucking leech scene. They literally picked the one move that would actually do damage against me. And it leech seed also has a small chance of actually hitting, so it's actually doubly annoying. Two Pokemon left, okay. If I get crit here, I'm gonna switch into Soy Rock. Cool. Reflect is down, so I should be able to do more damage. Alright, so here's what's happening. I'm switching into Soy Rock, because I'm tired of this move doing more damage than anything else they're trying to do to me. So you're not healing anymore, and I know for sure you're not about to use Leech Seed again. So I'm gonna have to ask you to kindly fuck off. You aren't gonna use Leech Seed against her? Okay, fine. Him. Why did that deal so much damage? <laughs> Why is your special defense way worse? Alright, I'm just gonna use quick attack. Done with you. Leave my sight. Rosalind. This thing, it's not the end. This thing could actually be kind of a pain in the ass. I say as it stuns Soy Rock. Wing attack. Eat a berry. Alright, I'm gonna very quickly switch back in Raider's Fan. 
and hope nothing bad happens. Let's see how much this does. It's way more than I would have liked. Alright, I'm gonna use this in case I get crit. I also realize that I'm actually running very low on potions now. That deals a lot of damage. It deals too much damage, so actually... Hello, Grazy. You're gonna take no damage from this. So this is where the fight ends. I was half wrong on that one. So let me very quickly use... Jesus. Why is this Rosary doing so much goddamn damage to me? I do think I have you cornered. You gotta be fucking kidding me. It actually is completely whipping the ass of Grazy. Alright. I don't think there's anyone. I'm gonna bring in Cyrock. I cannot believe that this Rosary is giving this much trouble. How does it know to stop using Grass Root? Grass Knot? That's my question. Because it's a fucking cheater Pokemon, that's how it knows. So now we're trapped in a forever loop because there's no way for me to get Paralysis off because it's just going to use Stun Spore again. So I'm just going to have to hope to God that Soy Rock gets through. And let's see how much damage this actually does. Great! <laughs> great! 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 Everything's fan-fucking-tastic. Drink the po drink the Gatorade, Sawyer Rock. Alright, so if you get crit, buddy, this is the end for you. So I'm gonna need you to not get crit, and actually also not get paralysis either. Come on. End the fight, please, for the love of the Lord. Oh, thank God. That was insane. I am very good, thank you very much. Alright everyone, that's the end of today's Nuzlocke. We were able to be, get our second gym, I'm happy about that. It was way harder than I thought, so it might be time to train up, because that fight was way harder because we did not have more Pokemon at the ready to switch into. So that's going to be the plan, everyone. I hope you liked this episode. If you did, you can leave a like. I always appreciate it when you do. It doesn't necessarily help the channel all that much, but it does help me keep motivated to keep making more. <laughs> so that's the end of today's video, everyone. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.